हेलो गाइज वेलकम टू द डेली लेट एंड मार्केट एनालिसिस वीडियो माय नेम इज अपूर वाई डेली मेक एजुकेशनल कंटेंट वीडियोस इन इंग्लिश ऑन ट्रेडिंग व्यू एंड इन हिंदी ऑन यूट्यूब बोथ द लिंक्स आप इन गिवन ऑन माय ओपन कमेंट बेस्ड टेलीग्राम व्हिच लुक समथिंग लाइक दिस यू कैन फॉलो मी लिंक इज गिवन इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन ऑफ दिस वीडियो वेर यू डिस्कस अलॉट ऑफ ट्रेड्स फॉर एग्जाम्पल लेट मी शो यू वी डिस्कस अबाउट एडोर वेल्डिंग and uh, the stock shot up 6% i was able to book some of the profits and still sitting with some of the profits uh, so i guess it closed sideways now the second stock was no sell it is 3% up and looked like that yeah it's going right the other trades were nifty trades and uh, let me discuss th those nifty trades first so in nifty uh, it was a good day for me for nifty uh, for the index i was able to get really good profits and but of course uh, these were hedged strategies and everything so yeah i went with the hedged uh, profits and something like that i will not be sharing uh, what i did because firstly i have to tell you about the whole procedure that how i am taking those hedged positions and everything like that so slowly and steadily i will be unlocking uh, those trades as well but yeah around at these levels i made my position uh, that was a hedged position of course i booked my profits at this level because i thought that this will be giving a this huge wick will be giving a rejection and yeah after that we consolidated but i was not able to take this uh, double top divergence uh, trade right here okay but yeah it's fine because once uh, there was a momentum on the higher side so what i said in the last video was that any trade that you get on the higher side i'm going to play it that this is this was the best trade you can see it, it was a morning star pattern then there was a breakout so yeah it was a good trade till this area good trade till this area also both the targets were done and if you check my last market analysis video you uh, you would know from those videos that after a consolidation on the higher time frames that is one hour time frame you will see that there is a supply zone so yeah this fall is okay i'm okay with this fall it's not like that we will be hitting these uh, targets soon okay what my psychology is uh, at this particular point is that if we open somewhere around this level tomorrow or a bit gap up right here okay i will be planning more long positions in nifty and bank nifty but i won't be shorting it uh, tomorrow directly under this level because we already saw a short uh, from the top okay we already saw a fall right now what what are the other trades that i'm planning again okay, nifty and bank nifty will discuss tomorrow on my telegram only link is in the description as you can see a lot of people are discussing a lot of trades there you can put your charts also so yeah let's move to some of the good trades short trades so tata steel <coughs> very good short trade uh, for future i'm seeing good support being broken okay it's not like uh, th that this is a direct fall as you can see it was a lower low lower high formation break away gap down and direct break of this um important support level that we were talking about 1060 so i would be waiting uh for intraday rise i will sell on rise for sure we'll discuss about these trades on my telegram only also after the trades been ex executed we'll discuss it on uh daily market analysis videos also so yeah this is my short trade the tata steel will be i will be shorting tata steel on every rise that it is making okay something like this if it rises i will be shorting it with some price action on intraday so yeah it's a short trade for intraday you can short it until unless we reach a substantial good amount on the bottoms okay now the other trades for the long side will be uh smc global it's making a good pattern here okay three rejections and as you can see right here okay a good trade can be formed from these levels with a small stop loss but still it is making a confusion candle so we can wait next trade is phoenix mills so i am seeing that yeah after a wedge pattern breakout it consolidated and making a a higher low formation two higher lows formation is uh, telling me that yeah the stock is bullish okay if it goes above this level okay that is a very good sign we can capture the long position in uh, phoenix mill so this should be on your radar jkil i'm gonna take this trade tomorrow if market gets bullish if it is opening sideways and moving up so that is uh, this is one of those trades that i'm gonna take sitting on a weekly supply demand conversion zone and giving a small pop out here so i'm gonna trade this pop out for seven eight percent let's see if how it goes shanti gear the same logic here but if you check monthly time frame shanti gear looks pretty good uh, higher high higher low formation on monthly time frames so of stock is uh, long term bullish contraction pattern broken but still 
whenever the contraction pattern is broken i wait for a retracement so this is the retracement that i got a v-shape retracement right here and i'm seeing a good candle popping out right here okay so at least at least the minimum targets will be uh four percent okay with a stop loss of four percent one is to one and then eight percent then twelve percent so these are my three targets uh gemna auto is the other stock if you open the weekly time frame you will see monthly supply demand conversions on the stock is sitting on then you go to daily time frame you will see that it is sitting at a very good uh, symmetrical pattern breakout and the candle right here is a confusion candle right doji or something spinning top type so it's a confusion candle if it comes down i'm gonna skip it goes up i'm gonna take the trade so that's uh, pretty easy because it's sitting at a good confluence circle moving ahead sepco uh, most of you guys uh, i guess took sepco because uh, i posted the chart on my telegram around 1040 people watched uh, this particular uh, chart right here so yeah looks pretty good to me uh, the higher targets the long term mid term uh, target could be 80 uh, for this particular trade let's hope for good but uh, if you check the price action 10% risk and 10% is the target for this particular stock as well so that is it uh, for this market analysis video we will discuss about the perfect trades and exits if any in other stocks as well on my telegram tomorrow morning if uh, market opens and uh, jkil sepco these are some of the important trades you should be keeping eye on and uh, if you have any uh, issues you can put it in the comment section or ask me on telegram i answer everybody as you all know uh, and yeah that is it for this market analysis video i hope you liked and enjoyed this video because these are very good trades that i picked uh, after analyzing like i guess 1600 stocks i analyzed today from the morning till uh, uh, till the market ends but i haven't taken any because uh, as you can see the market sell-off was pretty strong in the end let's uh, let, let's just check how the dow jones and everything is going so nasdaq has opened sdx nifty is sideways us market is showing uh 250 points gap up and dow jones has capped up or two a bit and moving on the higher side so yeah but we are also seeing a sell-off so 15 minute time frame let's see if dow jones sustains as uh, the is telling us a gap up tomorrow so i'm gonna push these uh trades for the long for the long that i've uh, just sh shown you these trades but if the market breaks the important crucial level of nifty tomorrow morning we'll see that how tata uh, tata steel goes uh, other metal stocks are not that good for the short but tata steel looks good for the short until unless we don't get uh, get a very huge candle here so we need huge buying okay so i will be selling only on a rise but we need a price action also on the 15 minute time frame so yeah that's it for this market analysis video we'll see you in the next video that will come tomorrow and if you want the hindi analysis for the same link will be given on my telegram only so if you have any doubts uh, ask me there okay thank you so much we'll see you